Okay, I'm dead. No, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no! No! I can hear you now, Dendi. We can talk. Okay, I give up. Hey, that's not worth it. We're not rotating to save uh, a hero. We're going to make sure we take an objective in that top lane instead. Uh, see back towards mid Thompson. And he's able to chase down the CM. A big ult comes out. Oh, no. oh, oh that's beautiful. Oh, the open AI. Crystal Maiden doing a big time there. And in fact, they're going to get this SF as well. As uh, back, really? on, back on form. It's a 95% here for open AI. From our human perspective, this is an even game, Owen. How are they saying 95%? I'm pretty sure even Dota Bless at the moment wouldn't be in the 90s, as this game does not look one-sided. Triple kill for the OpenAI Viper. Thompson, he's desperately looking for this Crystal Maiden, but the movement's here with the Shadow <laughs> Amulet, dancing herself away, utilizing the Invis to make sure that Thompson cannot get that final hit on her, continuing to use the Amulet, getting away out of this. Thompson, can he find this? He does get the vision for the Assassinate, but oh, there's the stun. Sable. The stun comes out from the cast, canceling the Assassinate. The Crystal Maiden kept safe and alive. Just looks fantastic. I wonder, do I they mean, have a four staff or If they get this them? kill, it's worth so much. Are but they they're, even not going to, Owen? they're not getting it. They're not getting it. Even do it. This viper will not die. They're uh, they're asking for the finishing blow to come in from the open AI. As open AI almost playing around with them at this point. Finger attempted onto the gyro. The stun from No Tail misses. Thompson's AFK. He's had enough of this one. As the ancient will fall, and that is GG game over. Open AI taking game two, taking the series two to zero. As a player of Dota 2, as a professional, you watch how Open AI just absolutely crushed. December 2016 marked a pivotal moment in the esports arena. Open AI, now already renowned for their cutting edge AI chatbot GPT, embarked on a new mission Open AI 5. Their goal, Train an AI to navigate the intricate world of Dota 2, a game celebrated for its requirement of both mechanical skills but also strategical knowledge. As we dive into the journey of OpenAI 5, we'll discover not just a game, but a revolution in machine learning. OpenAI's goal is to build safe, artificial general intelligence. We know that AI can be extremely beneficial to humanity. Dota is a great testbed for artificial intelligence. It's a very complicated game with a large competitive scene. For this project, we're building a Dota player. We're starting with a bot capable of beating top professional players at Dota 1v1. The rules of Dota are so complicated that if you just think really hard about how the game works and try to write those rules down, you're not even gonna be able to reach the performance of a reasonable player. So our bot is trained entirely through self-play. It starts out completely random with no knowledge of the world and simply plays against a copy of itself, which means it always has an evenly matched opponent. And it climbs this ladder of skill level until it's able to reach the performance of the best professional players in the world. The first public demonstration of OpenAI's prowess was unveiled at the International 2017. The arena was abuzz with anticipation as it was slated to challenge Dendi, a name synonymous with elite Dota 2 gameplay. Renowned for his unparalleled skills in the mid lane, especially with heroes like Pudge and Shadow Fiend, Dendi wasn't just any player, he was a legend in the Dota 2 community. As the match commenced, fans, experts, and competitors watched with bated breath, eager to witness the clash of human ingenuity against the zenith of machine learning. I never thought I would stand here and watch you play versus a bot and not know who's gonna win. Uh, I never felt so too. It's going in! In just three minutes, the arena witnessed the unimaginable. The AI, with its precise algorithms and predictive prowess, secured first blood and then, to the astonishment of many, clinched the game by defeating Dendi a second time. This wasn't just a victory in a match, it was a declaration, AI wasn't merely here to play, it was here to dominate. I can hear you now, Dendi. We can talk. Okay, I give up. Okay, so we're gonna do like best two out of five, or you're out, man. The hands are shaking, Dendi. Are you giving up? Yep. He's too strong. With a tone of both admiration and resignation, Dendi acknowledged the superior prowess of his opponent. I give up, he uttered, realizing the unprecedented might of the machine. This wasn't just about a single game, but a recognition of a new era in esports. As the dust settled from the machine's triumph, 
the team behind OpenAI 5 prepared to share a revelation that left the audience in the complete silence and shock. Brace yourselves. So this bot can actually learn from scratch in a span of two weeks of real time. And so after an hour of training, it's able to crush all the built-in bots. And after about these two weeks, that we're kind of at the level that we're seeing here today. Bloody hell. Two weeks. That's all it took for the machine to challenge the pinnacle of human skill. The future had arrived, not with a bang, but with an awe-inspiring whisper. Yet, this was merely the prologue for OpenAI 5. Their next ambition. Transition from a one-on-one -on -one skirmish to the full-blown chaos of 5 vs 5, challenging the world's top Dota 2 teams. In this format, the game wasn't just about skill, but intricate teamwork and deep-rooted strategy. The world watched as the AI transitioned from its initial achievements, keenly awaiting its performance in the complex ballet of team play, where every move counts, every strategy is crucial, and every player, whether of flesh or code, has a role to play. Would OpenAI 5 rise to the challenge, adapting to the multifaceted dynamics of team coordination and on-the-fly decision-making? In the heart of Shanghai, the Mercedes-Benz Arena transformed into the grand stage for the International 2019. Over five adrenaline-packed days, 16 elite teams clashed for supremacy in Dota 2. As the dust began to settle, only OG and Team Liquid remained, eyes locked on the coveted TI 2019 title and a staggering prize of $15.5 million. Liquid drew first blood but OG's indomitable spirit emerged triumphant, rallying to secure the next three games and with them, the championship crown. They achieved the unimaginable, securing their place as the absolute best in an ultra-competitive arena. Their victory was a testament to their unmatched blend of skill, teamwork, and strategy amongst their human peers. Yet, a new challenge loomed on the horizon, could they triumph over a machine? The match kicked off with OpenAI securing the first blood, signaling their readiness to challenge the best Dota 2 team. OG even implemented a unique strategy, pulling creeps on the aflame, anticipating the machine's inability to adjust. Yet, to many's astonishment, the machine had already anticipated and prepared for such a maneuver. For the next 18 minutes, the tides of battle seemed to tilt slightly in OG's favor. There was a hope that while OpenAI had shown its prowess in one-on-one -on -one matches, it couldn't replicate the team spirit and cohesion that OG embodied. But then, the game took an unforeseen turn. Crystal Maiden, they have that control. As they're back, really? on, back on form, it's a 95% here for OpenAI. From our human perspective, this is an even game, Owen. How are they saying 95%? I'm pretty sure even Dota Bless at the moment wouldn't be in the 90s, as this game does not look one-sided. It's very even in the net worth. While OG appeared to hold a slight advantage in terms of gold net worth, beneath the surface, algorithms were at work. The machine, using intricate computations and assessments beyond the realm of human perception, discerned an edge in its positioning. It confidently declared its probability of victory at over 95%, suggesting that it saw patterns and pathways in the game that even the most seasoned human observers might miss. From that moment on, OpenAI began to dominate the match, extending their lead with each passing minute. A mere 10 minutes later, OpenAI had decimated OG Space, securing their victory in the first game. And OpenAI take game one and cap they look pretty terrifying, it was close. With no room left for error in this showdown of humanity versus machinery, OG faced a daunting challenge. They needed to clinch the next two matches to affirm that, at least for now, humans still held the edge over machines. Game 2 showcased an even more dominant performance by OpenAI. Swiftly taking the reins, their lead grew unrelentingly with each tick of the clock. As the matches end neared, it became clear, OpenAI wasn't just on the verge of winning the game, but clinching the entire series in a decisive 2-0 sweep. Yet, at the 16-minute mark, a legendary moment emerged. Topson, one of the standout players of the International, was on the cusp of taking down Crystal Maiden. But what transpired next left the audience utterly spellbound. 
by Viper. Thompson, he's desperately looking for this crystal meta, but the movement's here with the Shadow <laughs> Amulet dancing herself away, utilizing the Invis to make sure that Thompson cannot get that final hit on her. Continuing to use the Amulet, getting away out of this. Thompson, can he find this? He does get the vision for the Assassinate, but oh, there's the stun. Sable. The stun comes out from the cast, canceling the Assassinate. The crystal maiden kept safe and alive. Five minutes later, OpenAI launched a decisive assault, obliterating OG space and clinching a commanding 2-0 lead. One. As the Ancient will fall, and that is GG, game over, OpenAI taking game two, taking the series 2-0, but honestly, this second game in particular, this is a fantastic example of something that, as a player of Dota 2, as a professional, you watch how OpenAI just absolutely crushed. As the final echoes of battle faded within the arena, a profound realization resonated through the crowd. The giants of Dota 2, Team OG, symbols of human passion and prowess, had been outplayed not by their peers, but by a symphony of algorithms, a wonder of machine learning. The Mercedes-Benz Arena in Shanghai, alight with thousands of awestruck fans, bore witness to a pivotal shift in competitive gaming. OpenAI, once a daring endeavor, now stood tall, signaling a new chapter in the narrative of artificial intelligence. In the same month, a four-day online event was held, inviting the public to challenge the bots. Over this period, the bots participated in 42,729 public games, clinching victory in a staggering 99.4% of them. This highlighted their near-unbeatable prowess. However, in 256 of these matches, Humans discovered strategies that caught the algorithms off guard, offering a glimmer of hope that we can still hold our own against the machines. Hey, yo, yo, what? Are no! What? No! Win probability? 100%? Did you ever say that again? 100%! <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. Ease clap. We did it. Oh my Let's go! <laughs> Open Humanity what? wins again! It's up to us, as humans and as a community, to guide the ethical evolution of AI technology for our benefit. As we've seen, machines can equal or even surpass human abilities in many domains. Our approach will determine whether we pave the way for a dystopian future or harness AI as a force for good, enhancing our lives without compromising our values. If you're still reeling from the astonishing capabilities of AI showcased in this video, here's another marvel for you. This entire video was crafted with the assistance of OpenAI's ChatGPT4. Yes, the very same company behind the indomitable Dota 2 bot. Please subscribe, like, and share to accompany us on this evolving journey. And always remember, we're only set to improve from here.